Recuperé la fe cuando yo a ti te vi, mami Bailabas como un ángel, me acuerdo de ese party No lo hacías despacito, no eras como Dari Eras como Bad Bunny, tu flow bastante cari, alright Me and Ashley are at the airport enjoying some mimosas before we go on our first vacation. Mine's a mimosa. Ashley doesn't like to drink in the morning. Our flight leaves at 9 a.m. and I think it's about four hours, so we should be there by 1 p.m. And I'm showing Ashley my new camera, which is the GoPro Hero 10. And look how excited she looks. Oh my god! It's our first trip outside the country, and I'm kind of nervous because uh, a lot of things happen in Mexico. So whatever happens in Mexico, stay in Mexico. Let's see about that. All right, so me and Ashley just landed in Cancun, Mexico. Okay, everybody knows who this female is right here. This one. She's the main squeeze for life. Anyway, so we basically got bamboozled as soon as we got out to the open where the taxi drivers are, as usual. Um, you have to wheel and deal some of them here. We had to wait at the bank for like 20 minutes because it was a crazy ass process. I believe Ashley told me that the hotel is about 40 minutes away from where we're staying. So yeah, we're about to go to our hotel, check in, and hopefully grab some food because I'm starving. Some people are like, they love golf courses. And cheers? First drink in Cancun, Mexico. Not bad. So me and Ashley gotta wait about an hour before we get into our hotel. All right, so me and Ashley are walking the streets in Mexico. It's like where all the nightclubs and shit are. Pretty cool. Me and Ashley agree this is like the watered down kind of touristy spot. So probably tomorrow when we hit up the city, it's gonna be way, way, way more lit. This is where we're sitting while we have our drinks. Well, all about the views. Tomorrow looks like it had a view over top of the town, so that's why I'm here. Holy fuck, they load this up with alcohol. <laughs> So in Mexico, they give you free shots to try out the tequila, which is pretty cool. What is this called? You said we could try it to see how it is? Oh, you mix two different ones together. Oh. Uh, it's like it. Oh. It's everything. Three years from barrica for tequila, and the other is barrica for whiskey. Oh. This is probably the one that they get all the locals with. Three, two, one. actually tastes very good. I like that. So I made reservations the other day for me and Ashley to actually come out to dinner and now we're here. Hello. We're like five minutes late for Brandon. Oh, okay, yeah, sure. Yeah, so I planned this a couple days ago. Uh, I decided to tell Ashley I had dinner reservations as we got here. This is very popular on TikTok, so I said, why not, let's go. Ashley seems excited already. Yo, babe, this is a vibe. So me and Ashley just sat down at the table. This is actually like a really cool vibe. And what's surprising is, is that it's cold out, but the wind's not hitting us. So Ashley, who's always cold, isn't cold right now. Gracias, senora. So I was gonna give a food review on their pizza, but their pizza's ass. It is not bueno. Gracias, senora. I'm about to tear this up. We still got the pizza coming in. Good morning, everybody. So it is our first full day in Mexico. Me and Ashley went out last night. We had some drinks, got some really good food, and the whole plan was to come back, grab Ashley's phone, uh, change a little bit, and then go back out. I was at like 8, 8, 8.30 last night, and uh, Ashley came over late on me, and we both just like fell right asleep. And then we woke back up at like four in the morning, and uh, we went out for a little bit. Like, we went out to go look at some of the bars, and some of them were open till like five, six in the morning, but we just weren't feeling it, so we came back. Now I'm waking up. This is my view right now in Mexico. I need a good beach day. I really do. All right, everybody. So it has been about three and a half hours. Ashley's still not ready, as usual. But you know what? She looks amazing. So that's all that matters. All right, everybody. So if you guys don't know this, this is me and Ashley's favorite drink. It is the pure white Hennessy. You can only get this outside of the country. They don't make this in America. 
I usually smuggle back about three or four of these for my friends. Special occasions, birthdays, whatever, but they're always good to give out because these are very rare. I love rare alcohol because when you come to a party with just regular alcohol, it's like, what the fuck? When you actually come to an event, party, wherever you're going, you have like alcohol that's not here in the US, people feel a little different when you give it to them as a present. So that's why I always bring back three or four of them. All right, so me and Ashley just got to the buffet and we have a beautiful view. Besides the beautiful view of Ashley, we're actually right next to the beach, which perfect weather today. And there's my other beautiful view. I only got some basic stuff right here. I got a little bit of grapefruit, I got some plantains, and then I got some like egg toast, whatever the fuck. That was to be um, toast. Yeah. I thought that was French toast. Nah. There's a little egg with a cut hole There's an egg in the middle, yeah. You about that life, huh? No, that was French toast all the time. Gracias, senor. We got it. Damn, look at that, glow up. Got it? Ooh. Yes, baby. You took that like a champ. Wow. You see how fast the cleanup is? <laughs> we just got done a little tiny mini shoot for Ashley. She actually likes maybe a tiny percentage of my photos and video. Hi. We're enjoying this nice little background right now. <laughs> Say hello, Ash. This is where me and Ashley are right now. We're at the pool. We got like a mini bar. So they got a bar where you can get drinks in the water and out of the water. But like, this is the view we got right here. All right, it's been two hours. I am definitely drunk. Ashley's getting there. She's getting there. We've been doing our little photo shoots every 10 minutes. The drunker and drunker I'm getting, I'm getting better as a photographer. I don't know what's going on here. I'm feeling Ashley, because look at this. Oh, my goodness. She don't like my jokes when I'm drunk, but I'm funny sometimes. So me and Ashley did a mistake again. We took a nap, and the nap was lovely. And now we're ready, and we're going out to the street. All right, so me and Ash just got down to the lobby slash like entertainment area. We grabbed a few drinks. What's great about the all-inclusives, obviously, we get free drinks. We get a nice little buzz going. We're gonna pregame, and then walk the streets, and then hopefully I don't get picked up or Ashley gets picked up, thinking we're prostitutes. Cause we look that good. Yeah. So, I decided this morning to get up early. There's a party at the beach with Jim they have here. Me and Ashley were extremely tired last night. We ended up going to bed around like 2, 2.30 in the morning instead of staying up to 5, 6 like everybody else was. So, I left the gym, came back, picked up Ashley, and now we're actually grabbing food. We got a lunch. Before we do anything. Alright, so it's our first shot of the day. Well, Ashley's third shot. All right, so me and Ashley decided to walk the beach and get some photos. As you may know, Ashley kills it as a model. My number one model right here. She just always got that natural glow going. We're just walking around grabbing some photos. Very nice day today, nice Sunday. Me and Ashley decided to wander the town of Cancun. It's right next to our hotel, because everyone was telling us that there's like this secret beach or like club over here where you can see everything. And apparently it's like lit. I think we might've found it, but we're gonna go all the way down here and see first. Okay, 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 my friend. It's a whole nother world we've been missing, babe. All right, so we just walked along the beach and now we're seeing this pretty much like a pier, like a natural pier over here they made. And we're gonna try to go to the end of it and take some photos. It's probably is the block off the tide and the crazy waves. Oh. You know what I mean? It separates it so these people don't get hurt. Yeah. These are actually big ass waves. But this is probably where the coral cuts off, where the reefs are. Crazy how white that water is. This is what me and Ashley are gonna be doing for the next hour or so. Just kind of thinking about what we want to do tonight. We're thinking about going to the city, but we just don't know where in the city yet. So we gotta figure that out ASAP. Right now, I'm just kind of enjoying the moment. Just watch. There you go, baby. Yeah. All right, so me and Ashley just got back from walking around town. We're sitting down and enjoying the little movie they got here, which I think is Coco. But me and Ashley are enjoying each other's time watching this little movie. It is me and Ashley's last full day here in Cancun, Mexico. We're actually taking the ferry over to some other beach. I can't even pronounce the name, so I'm not even gonna embarrass myself. But we're heading over on this big, big, like catamaran type thing. Alright, 
so this is actually like a cute little town. There's actually a lot more traction going on here, a lot more people. I guess we'll walk down towards this way, towards the beach. What are your opinions on this town already, Ash? I think it's a cute little I'm town. I'm judging right now. We haven't walked far enough down. I see potential there. Definitely potential here. A lot of people on TikTok review this as like the most beautiful town. And you have to actually come to this beach here because it's one of the top 10 beaches. This is the menu we have right here at the place we're looking at. I don't know if it's going to meet Ashley's standards, so I have to ask her. You want to keep going? Pass? You can try it. I don't think there's anywhere else. We're at the end of the actual beach. So we just sat down looking at the menu. We ordered our drinks. And I think I'm going to be going with the surf and turf. I'm going to go with the coconut shrimp. And then Ashley's still deciding, but knowing Ashley, she might get the New York strip or the ribeye steak. So this is the chicken tacos that I just got. The guy warned me because I said I wanted to get beef and chicken. He goes, oh, well, one is actually three of them, so I'm glad I didn't get the beef as well. And this is Ashley's chicken quesadilla. You can tell how happy Ashley is, as usual. So I just got my steak and my lobster. Ashley got her kebabs. So one thing I love about Ashley is that, one, she's a pain in my ass. I love that about her. Two, we love to travel, and three, we love food. Like. She's not one of those females that's like, no, I don't want to eat. She always wants to eat, even more than me sometimes. I love it. Now we're heading to the beach. This beach is beautiful. Jesus. Wow, look how beautiful that is. Oh my God. It's so beautiful. Me and Ashley actually just found a uh, little tiny bed on the beach. Literally the beach is right here in front of us. This is like the most beautiful view I've ever seen in my life. Did you get one? Like. Okay. Do you give me one too or no? Gracia. Wow, look at you. Yo, baby, you're the best. Oh my god. It's so beautiful. About to enjoy my drink. Live my best life, you already know. Me and Ashley are talking about how I'm very surprised I didn't get sun poisoning or sunburn at all because in all actuality I get sunburned very, very quickly. But all in all, I had a very wonderful day even though it was kind of cut short me and ashley kind of have an idea for the next time we come back we might go to temptations for three days and then come over here on the ferry and be here for three days me and ashley are going to run to the ferry we didn't know the ferry was at five we thought it was going to be at like eight o'clock at night it ended up being at 5 p.m so we got about a half hour to get there and we can see it from here so it's not that big a deal yeah. she wants you next to her yeah. so you stand next to her i take picture Ow. Uno, dos, tres. Holy shit. They're probably just caught. Yo, look at this. Yo, look at these ones down here. These are the bigger, bigger ones, babe. Look at that fucking. Jesus Christ. Holy fuck. Got some bacon, some sausage, and I don't know what the fuck this is. There's some type of bread or something on it. Pretty much the buffet. I will say the buffet has been exquisitely clean every time I've been here. I've not had any issues. One day when we're out, the other buffet had a tiny hair, but I couldn't tell if it was mine or somebody else's, so I can't really fault them for that. I gotta be somewhat fair. Did you get it? Uh -huh. Alright, they have Sarah up in there. And this is where we're going to be leaving, this beautiful paradise. And me and Ashley will give her honest review on this place once we're out of here. Not like we have anything bad to say, it's just do's and don'ts, etc, cetera, etc. Cetera. And the pros and cons of actually going to an all-inclusive versus just regularly booking a hotel here. Alright, so me and Ashley just got in the taxi and we just checked out of our hotel. Overall, I had a great experience. You know, we had maybe one, one night where it 
wasn't the greatest due to me being too drunk and too emotional. But it's kind of nice because I've never experienced kind of having a romantic vacation and just spending time with my significant other for a few days. The food was decent, for sure. The all-inclusive is definitely the way to go. I can see why people are all about all-inclusives. The drinks, the pool, the beach, it was amazing. That's my review. How was your review? Um, definitely overall, I've seen good vacation. Unfortunately, I had one day planned to go to Tulum to take Ashley out to dinner, but uh, we couldn't find a taxi driver to take us there, probably under $100. So the next time we're here, we're either going to spend maybe two or three days in Tulum, two and three days in Cancun, and then maybe one day at the beach that we're at because it seemed very nice over there. But that is my review. I liked it. You know, we had some pros and cons, some do's and don'ts, but that's what traveling is all about in different countries, learning the culture, learning what's good, what's not good, and etc. So that is my opinion. I'm glad that I got to spend it with Ashley. All right, guys, see you at the airport.